you all today. I hope you're all well. As you could tell, I've woken up and I'm actually a lot worse than what I was yesterday. I've lost my voice. My chest is really bad. But I still got to go on and do things. So I got to ask Paul today and I'm ready. I just got to get Esme's t-shirt on and then she's ready. Also, then I'll just put her in her pram put my shoes on and we're leaving. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to film today because obviously I just don't feel well at all. But I'm going to try my best to make it a bit better, like, to film some up. Because I can't use the excuse I'm ill because other people get on and do things when they're ill, don't they? just got to go on and do it. So I don't, I'm definitely not going to be going out after I've finished with the hospital. I'm going to come home. So it's going to be another home day, but I think I might have a look around the shops because there's shops right near the hospitals. I might have a look around the shops. So I need to get Esme some new leggings uh, and I need to get myself some leggings. But depending on how I feel later on, I don't know well, you'll see it anyway if I do. So yeah, I just got to finish getting Esme ready, then I got to leave, so I'll speak to you all in a bit, guys. I'm at the hospital now, guys. I feel a lot better than what I did this morning. I'm not sure what I could film up here, so I might let you know how I get on anyway after. So I'm going to have a look around Primark after, I think. So I'll speak to you all in a bit. So for a change, guys, it's not actually me that's running late. It's actually the doctor that's running late. I feel so much better. I mean, it's just that I've had, obviously, I've not really spoke much because, obviously, my um, I lost my voice this morning, but... As you see, my voice has come back. So, yeah, I hate this week because it's the longest boring bit. There's Esme. She should be going to sleep, really. But, yeah, I feel so much better. But I feel like I've got a lot of energy as well. And I think that's just because um, before I like, come in, I went into the shop and had, I got myself a um, soaring bar and a bar of chocolate. And I got they, Daisy, Esme, a, a bar of chocolate as well. Not that she could eat it, but I just like melts it in my finger for her and then rubs her dummy on it. Um, so yeah, it feels a lot better now. I had something to eat as well, because I didn't really have much for tea last night. I did do myself a bowl of soup, but I didn't eat it. So now I'm just waiting for the doctor, and then I shall let you all know what I'm doing. So guys, I'm back from the hospital. Everyone, everything went fine at the hospital. The consultant's really pleased with my blood sugars, because they've all obviously been low and in, within target. Um, she said to me, now I don't have to start the metformin or insulin until later on in pregnancy or not as my blood sugars decide to spike. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm still quite feeling quite rough. Feeling a lot better than what I did this morning. My hair looks a mess even though it's been brushed, but I can't bother with it today. Um, I'm in the middle of preparing tea. I'm making a chicken curry for tea. Esme Zabin. I'll show you now. Esme Zabin. Cheesy veg and pasta for tea, which I'm going to be doing Esme's in a bit. And then she'll have two yogurts for after. Um, other than that, like, I ain't really got really much to report. I think this vlog's going to be quite short, short and sweet. I didn't even um, manage to go into Primark in the end. I just got in the hospital and I felt, I started to feel really rough again. So I just said to Matt, like, I'm going to go in. Um, I went and got, quickly, quickly got something to eat first. And um, yeah, but cool, I went in the shop in the hospital and I bought myself a bottle of water and I bought Esme a bottle of water and I bought a bar of chocolate and it cost me six pounds. I couldn't believe it. I, I, I thought, oh, I think I've been overcharged. And then went into I looked like the bottle of water was like nearly two pounds. And if I was in that, I would have went to my local shop first or when I got off the bus in town, I would have went into Pangland. But hey, I was done now and it, obviously Esme needed a drink and I wouldn't, they didn't really like to give her juice. Not this is baby juice. So I thought, right, just give her a bottle of water. I do need to do Esme's bottles, obviously, you can see them. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be doing tea now and gonna obviously feed Esme her tea and then um, give Esme a bath. I shouldn't get back last night and then I need a bath myself and then I'll speak to you all in a bit. Hey guys, I didn't end the vlog last night, as you can make sure you tell. I just, I just felt really ill myself and I thought I, I got to go to bed, so I had a little bit of tea. I didn't end up giving Esme a bath last night, Matt did. So I went, I went on the bed and Matt sorted Esme out. Like after I did her tea, I had, I had myself a little bit of tea, I went to bed. And then I, obviously I think that sleep did me overall good because obviously I, I'm feeling a lot better today. Um, I've got, so I'm going to end the vlog here and I'll see you tomorrow on my next daily vlog.